imagine architecture in the clouds, right? And digital transformation in Alibaba Cloud Philippines team. He plays a crucial role in helping organizations navigate the complex landscape of cloud technologies and develop innovative solutions to address their business challenges. We have with, her, we have with us Mr. Grant Gong on Ali, of Alibaba Cloud to present on the topic cloud-based Moodle optimization, performance and security. Big round of applause, please. moment as we say okay angels are passing passing by okay so are you are you still doing great fellow learners yes but it is a very silent whisper how about the others are we still very much in yes. yeah belonging to the team alive yeah and it's a Friday right July 7 How are you? Yeah, good, of course, yeah. Okay. Are you enjoying the Philippines crowd? Yes. Best crowd ever. <laughs> best crowd ever, yeah. That's the best place ever. Okay, thank you. About you, sir. Yesterday you had questions. And today? writing my questions. Oh, okay, for later. Okay, okay. So are we good now? By the way, these things always happen in conferences, right? Here we are. So in my section, I will uh, briefly introduce how the cloud solution could be used in your LMS system. I saw uh, most of you already adopt LMS, right? But if we are talking about the cloud, so how to leverage the cloud to elaborate your application? I think there are many fields we need to explore. And firstly, I would say in Philippines, the cloud market is about is booming, it's about to explore. And uh, according to the statistical data, and I would say the public cloud market grows very quickly. And many education institutions are leveraging the cloud to adopt their LMS, online education, and also school management system in the cloud. The main target of this cloud adoption is we can use the cloud to save the cost. And in the cloud, there are many kind of paths and SaaS solutions that can elaborate your club, uh, you know, with your business and the education growth, okay? <laughs> and here I will say uh, why we need cloud for the education. There are several characters. For example, the scalable and also reliable infrastructure. Currently, DevLab Web can provide the Moodle applications and most of the applications is running on the cloud. And uh, currently in Philippines, we have a local data center. That means the model application which is running in the local data center can provide you the reliability and also high speed to access the LMS application. Additionally, in the cloud, there are many kind of database and also big data solutions. So in the future, you may have more and more participants to attend your applications, attend your LMS service. You definitely need some big data solutions to further optimize the application and elaborate your system. 
last thing is the security and the compliance. I would say there are many kind of key information of the school of the student, and this kind of information should be stored in the cloud or within the country, within the Philippines. So in the cloud, there are many kind of security measures to protect your information, protect your data, and also your system. This is very critical for some uh, pub uh, public sectors, government, and also universities. <laughs> and here is a, a big picture uh, of Alibaba Cloud global infrastructure. I think most of uh, the attendees today are local uh, universities, right? But if you already have some foreign student, definitely you can provide the online education. And you want to deliver the online course across the world. So in, uh, for Alibaba Cloud, we have global extensive IT infrastructure. So you can deploy your applications, online education platform across the world. And we also have thousands of city nodes. That means if you deploy your LMS in Manila Data Center, you can use the CDN to accelerate the content delivery to the global student. This is very critical to improve your online education experience. So when we are watching the video in the MS, maybe in China, in Australia, but the system in the Philippines is still very seamless and uh, there is no latency. Uh, okay, here is our local data center. I would say uh, in Philippines, we already built our local presence. We also invest in the local infrastructure. That means you can leverage the local cloud service for your uh, education applications innovation. But currently, most of the universities, most of the academies are still use the on-premises center. That means their applications, their MS is still deployed on-premises. So in this section, we still have some cloud solution to improve your data security, that is the backup. For example, uh, if you have your own data center and there may be some system failures, natural disaster, may need to the school information, course information, or student information loss. So in this case, we need to use the backup to backup the database, user information, and also education information into the cloud. In case there are some failures or data loss, we can restore. Another part is how to migrate your Moodle application to the cloud. Maybe most of your uh, Moodle is already in the cloud, right? But some of them uh, still need to consider how to move the on-premises system to the cloud. We can provide, uh, here are some details. I don't want to uh, go through them. But I will say we can provide the technical service together with our uh, level web partner and the delivery the migration. And we also uh, provide some migration tools to migrate your uh, school system, student management system, and our LMS to the cloud uh, with short downtime and a disruption. <laughs> okay, here is the main topic. If your application is already cloud-based, so such as uh, the Moodle application is deployed on Alibaba Cloud, but there are still many directions we need to consider to optimize your ap application. The first one is the traffic acceleration. Just as I mentioned, if you have some foreigner student, how to make sure they visit your LMS with high speed? This is what we need to consider, that is the traffic acceleration. Another one is the scalability improvement. So for the LMS platform, during the uh, teaching time, the workload may be very high, but during the idle time, such as in the light, there will be no such high workload. So that is why we need to consider the scalability to improve your cloud usage and the cloud governance. That's the way in the security. Okay. So regarding the traffic acceleration, that is the CDN solution. So with CDN, we can highly accelerate the customer visit to your LMS. Currently, we've already deployed thousands of city nodes across the world. That means we can accelerate your MS user experience, we can accelerate the traffic to the global with high speed. 
and this can be widely used for the LMA, uh, for the website acceleration, downloading, streaming, and mobile acceleration. Of course, for most of the universities, academies, I think you have your own application, right? So in this case, CDN can be also used for the acceleration. Another one is for the auto scaling. Currently, uh, we already work with Nefla Web to launch several MS system for Philippine universities. And one of the key solutions we adopted is auto scaling. So the system can auto scale their capacity based on the user's traffic. Additionally, they leverage the cloud native database with high scalability. <coughs> Here is one of the uh, architecture that is leveraged by uh, Level Web to launch the Moodle application. So in this architecture, we use the CDN for the acceleration and the load balancer and auto scanning are used to scale your system capacity. And regarding the data management, okay, for the user information, student information, teacher information, we will manage it by our database. And for the training course, such as the video, such as the image, if you are stored in the object storage. <coughs> Currently, uh, in the universities, I think many professors are researching the cloud native, right? Because cloud native is an approach consists of several advanced technologies such as microservice, IAC, observability, uh, CICD. So microservice is a new kind of is a kind of new technology can improve your application scalability. And um, the Kubernetes cluster, the container could be leveraged to further improve your MS performance. So in this section I would say Alibaba Cloud can provide you the full stack of cloud native solution to help you to achieve the DevOps, uh, AIOps, FinOps, and so on. This is very critical uh, for some uh, university IT department to improve the IT governance. Regarding the security, I would say there are many kinds of uh, solutions we can explore to improve your system, data, and information security, such as vulnerability, data security, networking security, and identity security, right? And on the top of that, we also need to consider the audit. So here in the Philippines, we already work very closely with Tesla and also DICT to launch some security solutions and also guide some uh, security circulars to improve the security, the IT security in Philippines market. Here is one of the best practice we already, uh, it's already validated by Philippine customers. We are able to uh, use the full stack security solutions to protect your LMS traffic and protect your LMS server and avoid the data leakage. So when we are talking about the cloud, it's not just uh, the SaaS service such as uh, uh, Google uh, G Suite, Google Workspace, and uh, Zoom, and, and also some other PaaS service, right? So in the, for, from the for infrastructure perspective, our solution, could, I could say, has been widely recognized by the market, such as the IDC, Gartner, and Forrester. So if you want to safeguard your Moodle application, definitely the security can be used to protect the traffic, protect the students' data. And if you want to elaborate the Moodle application to the cloud native, there are four stack of container solution to help you to re-platform and optimize your Moodle uh, platform. Additionally, the database could be widely used to improve the scalability and also reliability of your application data management. Okay, here is the last page I just want to uh, quickly go through. So if you want to migrate or adopt your Moodle application or other school management system, definitely Alibaba Cloud infrastructure service could be widely used. We offer four stack of cloud computing solution, such as a cloud server, container, Kubernetes, and a storage networking solutions. And on the top of that, there are many kind of database solution, big data, and AI capabilities could be leveraged. 
and currently the AI GC is a very hot topic, right? So we are able to deliver the GPU instance and also the AI platform that can be offered to academies and universities to improve the teaching regarding the machine learning and AI course. On the top of that, there are also many kind of security solutions. So if you move your application or adopt your platform into the Alibaba Cloud, there is no worry about the data leakage, no worry about the traffic and the application security. Okay, so that's the all of my presentation. I just want to give you an overview of Alibaba Cloud local presence here and how our solution can elaborate your Moodle applications. And of course, we work closely with our partner to deliver, implement, and also maintain the Moodle application here uh, for Philippines customer. Thank you. Uh, we have the opportunity to ask questions. So, do you have anything? Okay, maybe my section is a little technical. Uh, so if you have any question about maybe how to elaborate your platform, feel free to discuss it. Yeah. Do we have any uh, interesting question there? Technical that is going to be of use to all of us anyway. Okay, I will say, uh, maybe I can give some more comments, okay. So, I think most of you already uh, seen, uh, saw that the online education is very important, right? So many Philippine academies and universities, they just want to use the sun service and purchase the Zoom meeting and purchase the G Suite and workspace. Of course, this is a very easy way to launch your online education. But if you want to further improve your service uh, features, definitely you need to consider your in-house solution. That is why today we, have, we are here working with the Leffler Web. So in this part, our position is, our role is, we can provide the innovation engine. We work behind uh, our partners, such as Leffler Web. We provide the cloud technology and empower their service innovation. And finally, we provide the service together to the universities. So maybe uh, in the future, if you leverage the LMS and the system is running on Alibaba Cloud. Okay, so if there are no more questions, I think we can go proceed to the next section. Okay, next session. Next uh, speaker. Yeah, I have, uh, I have a question. Okay. Yeah, so. Are you are you uh, accommodating interns? Uh, interns, you mean the talent? Yes, yeah. apprentices. Yeah, so coming from the schools to bridge, you know, to transition before they get ready for actual employment. Okay, uh, we how say here Alibaba in Philippines we are not just still our cloud computing solutions. We are also want to. Uh, train the talent here. So that is why we launched many training programs here. We have the certification, we have the training, we can, we can also offer some intern opportunities for the talent and help them smoothly move to the employment. Of course, we have marketing team here, Tess, and he is currently leading our training program. And we already also launched some innovation lab here in Philippines, such as with APC University, right? Oh, wow, so so the big answer is yes then. Of course. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's great news. Yeah, it's great news. Can we give the uh, uh, big round of applause? We get in touch with you, ma'am. And uh, sir, because I think yeah, there will be a lot will be very interested in you know becoming a like a newbie, fresher trainees of your company so that they can better be employed by companies out there, right? Okay, so, yes, and I'd like to request you to go on stage again. Sorry for that, yeah? Yeah, we'll award you uh, our appreciation and uh, 
simple token. Maybe we can request. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so in grateful recognition of your sharing of expertise and knowledge. Yeah, given this July 7th at the Century Park Hotel Manila in our conference labeled Moodle Mood Philippines 2023. Thank you so much.